One might think that after the Israeli army shot and killed Yasser Murtaja, the Palestinian journalist in Gaza, they would be extra cautious when aiming at other journalists. But this was not the case with Ahmed Abu Hassim. An Israeli sniper fired a bullet at Abu Hassim's stomach while he was standing at a permissible distance from the border fence and was doing his job, documenting the march of return. He was gravely injured on Friday, but only on Sunday, the Israeli army let Abu Hassim pass through Israel to a hospital in Ramallah to get a treatment that might save his life. That's how long it took the Israeli army to decide whether a journalist doing his job would receive the right to get adequate medical care. You see, the Israeli army had to actually breach a rule that says that Palestinians participating in the demonstrations will not be able to pass through Israel to hospitals in Jordan or in the West Bank to receive medical treatment. As a journalist, it hurts me when other journalists are being hurt while doing their job. I call everyone involved to respect the need and the importance of documenting important events without journalists having to fear for their lives.